Hi, it's hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. All right, so hello everyone. 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 And today, I would like to take a um, few minutes before this video starts, before we actually play something. I would like to talk about my league experience in the past couple of weeks, months. Thing is that I started League only last year and it was the end of the season almost so I didn't have the time to climb. Everything I played didn't feel quite fine for me to play competitive. I started playing support right away and I felt like okay that's what I want to do because the plane is too difficult, mid is too difficult, jungle is something I would never ever be ready to do in my life because pretty much everything depends on you on your roamings, on how fast you do camps, on how fast you do drakes and like rift heralds and like barons and stuff so like you gotta be really fast on everything you do pretty much but like playing support and playing with someone who can help you out I hope, I mean not in my elo and I tried tanky supports I don't know if you guys know but I started playing thresh um the first times and it felt really comfortable because uh, all the people I played against if only my whatsapp messages wouldn't be popping out yeah but the thing is it didn't qu it didn't quite feel alright I didn't feel like I'm actually helping out my teammates it didn't feel like I do damage even though I know tanky support they're there just to support for me, support is something more than that, and I obviously wanted to do more. I obviously wanted to be able to carry my game along. Okay, my mid lane is losing, my uh, top lane is losing. Uh, we can still do it, we can still come back. After that, I tried different supports. I tried mages, uh, mostly healers. Um, yeah, but again, I, I really needed damage and I felt like when I played Soraka, Lulu, um, who is there else? Nami? It feels like, yeah, I'm healing, I'm doing a lot for my teammates, but I can't really fight anyone. I <laughs> like, I can't be there and I can't do damage. That's what I was, uh, like, that's what I, want, I wanted to say. And then... I think it was a curse of mine, honestly. I found out about Lux. I knew about her uh, uh, before, right before I started playing Thrash, but she didn't feel as comfortable as I feel on her right now. So like right now, I feel like, okay, I can go help mid, okay, I can go help Drake, I, ha I can help jungler, I can rotate, I can do damage which was really important for me and i can also be there for my ad care obviously and uh now uh i don't know if you guys know people who are on my discord obviously know that i do main lux now and I, it just feels great i feel like i can melt enemies especially like a uh, late game i'm not talking about tanky Top laners, tanky mid laners, if there are. So let's be honest. Sona, Soraka, they don't really do damage, do they? After I found out about Lux, I started. I reached level 30 and I started playing ranked. It was like, let's say, October, November of the last year. I realized that I have a problem. I realized when Lux is getting banned or she's being picked, um, I can't really do much because I I try to force myself to play Soraka because I know that many people love like when there's a healer on their team basically. I tried Lulu, I tried Nami, and as I said, it didn't feel quite good as on Lux. There was a problem for me. Because what am I gonna do if Lux is gonna get picked or banned? And then I found out about um, Senna. That's like my second pick right now and I'm pretty good on her. Um, I have like really good matches. Um, and she's actually helping me win a lot of games. Like 
a lot of games and I have a really high win rate on her as well. Um, I don't go Kraken Slayer to her, instead I go with the other item, I'm not sure how it's called, Divine Sunder or something. I go with that, and her roaming potential is pretty good as well. Like, if we compare us, uh, Senna and Lux, uh, about roaming, like, if I want to roam a lot the game, I choose Senna. Like, that's, uh, everything. Because you press her E, I guess, um, and you're basically moving way faster than you would be running with Lux. That's pretty good as well. I love it about Senna, but <laughs> yeah, her old cooldown is not as good as like Lux 20 seconds uh, late game cooldown or like 15. Senna's cooldown is like what, 100? I think about that. So I started uh, ranked games this season, so like this year basically, and no, I mean, let's be honest, I started before that last season, but it was impossible to climb because I, I didn't... I played Lux, she was picked, I had to force myself to play Lulu or Soraka or Sona. I tried Sona a lot and her late game is... Yeah, that's something you want to you wanna have. But again, if someone jumps on you, if Kha'Zix jumps on you... Literally, Sona is so defenseless. She's really, really weak in the beginning of the game, like, she's like, sugar. So, yeah, who else did I try? I tried Morgana, but it wasn't quite the same as Lux, um, but she's still pretty good. Uh, and I know in high elo, people usually ban Morgana because her stun is really annoying and lasts a lot. Tanky support's not for me, definitely, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so now I have my two uh, mains, it's Lux and Senna, and I feel the most comfortable playing them. And the thing is that now, since I started playing ranked, you know, League is a, has a really hmm, disgusting community, as I would say, uh, and people are really mean, especially in like uh, low elo, where I am right now. Um, and it's really, really difficult to climb. I mean, I don't know if it's really difficult to climb for me or just like for everyone right now, but I did move a bit and it's the third month right now since the, since the new season came out. So, uh, what I wanted to share with you guys is what I met in my uh, bronze elo really interesting picks I would like to share with you. So basically there was a game we had... I had um, Mastery 80 carry. Okay, let's be realistic here. If you're a challenger, you can play uh, Lulu mid, you can play Lulu top, you can play Lulu jungle and probably it's gonna work for you, I don't know. But, ma like, if you're bronze and you're trying to climb, I mean, if you're trying to climb, of course. <laughs> I don't know what that guy was doing there, but, I mean, uh, he tried, he tried. And there was a guy who was like, oh my god, have you seen like those Korean challengers playing Master? You're not a Korean challenger, are you? You're just a person who is trying to climb. Mm, what else have I seen? I know that Mordekaiser Jungle now has um, a high win rate. Or what does it have? I don't know, like, many people play him now. Uh, Jungle, I mean, his damage is crazy for a jungler, so maybe that's why. And I've seen, um, really scary now, I've seen Teemo Jungle in my bronze lobbies. I wish, I wish you could dodge just like you can dodge in Valorant. Because in League, it takes like, if you dodge once, in champ select, it takes 5 minutes. If you dodge twice, it takes t 10 minutes and goes further and further. But like, please Riot, if I see... If I see Massey 80 carry, I don't think I want to play with that, honestly. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, maybe that guy is smurfing, but he wasn't. <laughs> he wasn't, and it was really bad because like he was struggling and it was like noticeable 
for me is like I, I don't remember I think I was playing Lux that time and I tried to help him as best as I could but it was just impossible because I think there was like Jin and Nautilus um the enemy team and they were poking him like Jin was poking him um uh, really easily so like there was nothing I could do for him to help him yeah but I think that's it for now I hope I won't see any other weird picks like Holo Jungle. I mean, when I play Valorant, I at least see, okay, I'm doing a progress. Okay, like, I was Silver C, now I'm Gold 1. Okay, I wanna, I wanna get there. I wanna maybe be a Plat one day. But in League, it's just every time I play, even though I can go... For example, I have a game where I went... Uh, let me see... I went 15-4-22 Senna against one uh, 16 Lux. She basically peaked before me because I really wanted to play Lux. Um, and I was like, okay, then I play Senna. And um, that was my revenge on her, <laughs> I guess. I can go like a uh, really high kill penetration on Senna or on Lux, but doesn't seem like I'm doing any progress, like I'm moving at all. But I don't know how it's gonna be. Like in today's video, I just wanted to share like my um, league experience when I started and how it is now. And um, I wanted to show you some bronze games. So if you're interested and you wanna see how struggling it is in low elo and how toxic community is, um, I'm probably gonna see it here.